Hey, Patrick here with a tech tip video for today. I am a civil technical specialist with ATG USA. Today we're going to be covering docking features. Docking features are useful for if you're working off of one laptop or one computer screen. A lot of us are working from home right now and uh, may not have the luxuries of using multiple monitors. Um, here I have a few examples of some things that might be up on another monitor screen. and I'm going to show you how to dock them so you can use one screen and still have the luxuries of having two screens. If you take one of your pallets here and you right click on it and you hit allow docking and then you can anchor to the left or to the right. For this example over here I'm going to anchor it to the left. Same with this one on my layer properties manager. Allow docking. Anchor it to the left. Over here I have my properties uh, palette. I'm going to anchor, allow docking and then anchor this one to the right. Sheet set manager for an example. Allow docking. Anchor to the right. Now you can see that you have all this extra space here as normal. But you still have your palettes over here that you can access if you have one screen. Another uh, nice feature or tip would be to turn off your tool space if you're working off of a really small laptop. That will give you more real estate to work on. Turn that on and off as needed. And then one more piece is this uh, ribbon minimize button here. You're going to select it a couple times and now you have the little drop down arrows or drop down tabs here gives you all the same things as if it was expanded, you just don't get the big icons for it anymore. And that's all I have for you today. Um, stay safe out there everyone, and I'll catch you with the next video.